people of YouTube. I'm back. I know I haven't been on for very long, but I'm here now and I have a new camera and I'm filming this because I'm leaving for Alabama to go to Christmas vacation. And I wanted to do a little thing since it's getting to the end of the year. And that is the five cosplays that I have loved this year that I've done. So let's get started now. So on to number one. And that is my Wendy cosplay from Gravity Falls. Um, you can see that it's one of my favorites. I love it so much. Like, so much. And it makes me happy to see it because, one, Alex Hirsch loved my costume. He loved my journal as well that I made. And now the page is in it and everything like that. And it was, I just loved that character so much. Because I love Wendy. She was my favorite character in that entire show. I relate to her a lot, and she was, and she's my age too, so it works. Um, but yeah, that's Wendy was my favorite, one of my favorites to do, and I still love her. I love cosplaying as her as much as if I get the chance, I will do it. I've done it to school and everything. So number two on the list is my Chuck Shirley cosplay from Supernatural. I enjoyed doing that because I loved Chuck. Like I love Chuck. Chuck Shirley was the best for me. He was like everything. And I just, I liked him a lot. And I also had, a, I have a huge crush on Rob Benedict. Huge, major crush. And we went to the Supernatural convention and I was dressed as Chuck and we were in the third row. And there's probably videos on YouTube of what happened, I swear. And I was pulled up because I thought he, I was late for his panel. So I'm walking in and he had already started and he saw me and I got pulled up on stage. And there are pictures of me with him on stage. And I just have the stupidest grin on my face. And it's hilarious, really. Um, but I liked it a lot and it was so much fun to be Chuck. And I still love to, be, to cosplay as Chuck. It's one of my favorite things ever, really. So for number three on the list, I have my Dean Winchester cosplay that I've actually done twice so far. Two times, yeah. I've done it for the same convention, actually. I haven't done it for any other conventions yet. Yet. My Dean cosplay, I did it because I just... Dean is one of, one of the best characters other than Chuck. Dean is one of the best characters in Supernatural because I relate to him so much. I, I like Me and my mom, we always talk about how we're Sam and Dean and I'm always Dean and she's always Sam and it's completely true for us. Completely true. And it's really fun to be Dean. I also made the first Blade from the, not the newest season, the season before season 10, I believe. I made the first Blade and there's pictures of that. And actually the prop master of Supernatural really liked it and I, Felt like that was one of the best things ever, honestly. On to number four on my list, and that is my Rowena cosplay from Supernatural. She was, I loved her. She was just that spark in the flame, and she was just amazing. Just the fact that she's Crowley's mom was the best ever, like, seriously. And I liked her red hair. I already had a red wig. This is actually my cosplay for Rowena, is a closet cosplay closet cosplay. I had a black shirt with sleeves on it from the Renaissance Fair, and my mom had a black dress, and I had black heels. And there was my Romina cosplay, and I did it for Comic Palooza, which was the first time I did it. And then my friend did Crowley. There are pictures of that, and, there, and I will show you right now. Here they are. And I just loved it, because it was a closet cosplay, and I had the wig, I had everything for it, so I was just like, let's go for it. Comic Palooza, here comes Rowena. And then I also did it for Geeked Con, along with my Dean Winchester cosplays that I did. And she's just fun to cosplay as, because no care is given. <laughs> and then my last cosplay, which is number five on the list, is my Quicksilver cosplay. The I cosplay as Quicksilver from the movie Days of Future Past. Um, it's not all completely accurate, honestly, but no cosplay is completely accurate unless somebody says it is. I won't, I won't judge them if they say that their cosplay is completely accurate, accurate, but I just, mine isn't accurate. Like a lot of my cosplays aren't accurate. I mean, we don't look like the person, so of course we're not completely accurate to it. I mean, nobody's perfect, but, um, 
I love my Quicksilver cosplay. It was, I love it so much. I like my jacket, I like my shirt, I like everything. My favorite thing to wear is actually the wig and the goggles and the headphones. I really enjoy that. And I've done that cosplay for, I'd say about four conventions, maybe. One of them, it was a closet. It was just a spur of the moment thing. I had the wig, I had the goggles, I had a Pink Floyd shirt. It wasn't the Pink Floyd shirt. But I had it, and actually somebody, I walked by a booth, and they were like, that's not the real Quicksilver, and I was like, so? I like doing what I do, you can shut up. Because it's what I like to do, and you can't judge me for anything, I swear. It was just, Quicksilver is one of my favorites. I liked him in the movie, he was like, it was just amazing to see him, and I was just like, Quicksilver's really cool in this movie. So, that is my top five cosplays. I could ramble on all day about them, but I kind of cut it down a little bit to like some quick short things of why I cosplayed them, how many times, and all that kind of stuff. I hope you enjoyed this, and I enjoyed being here, I enjoyed being back for YouTube. I'm on school break, so hope, you guys better hope that you see more videos from me. Merry Christmas! Happy New Year's, and I will see you all with my IkiCon vlog I hope to actually do. Bye.